Alexander Volkov once again failed to get over the hump in his quest to become UFC heavyweight champion on Saturday when he lost a critical contender's fight with Cyril Gaon at UFC Fight Night 190. For this fight, it was essential for Volkov to get his hand raised. He's had some slip-ups in the past in some very big spots in his career. This happens again now in a fight where he was definitely competitive, but gone to seem to be the better at mixing it up on the feet, mixing up his whole overall game, and Volkov really could just not get the momentum going and have that nastiness to him that we've seen in some of his other recent performances. By no means do I think Volkov is written off yet as a potential heavyweight title challenger sometime down the line, but has some rebuilding to do once again. He's been in this spot before, fortunately, still a relatively young guy for a heavyweight, and I think can and will bounce back from this. It's just a matter of against who in this division right now, and I think if you're looking around at who would be the most logical, available op opponent for him, I think Marcin Tybura, definitely a guy that makes sense. Tybura, as we know, on a hot streak in his own right in this weight class, five consecutive victories in the heavyweight division, doing some really great stuff, and I think he has earned a step up in a big recognizable contender like Volkov. After his last win, he called out Curtis Blades, who ended up being paired up against Jairzinho Rosenstruck, and I think just by the process of elimination, we now have a sensible fight between Volkov and Tybura. Not sure how much time off Volkov is going to want here. He's been relatively active over the past year or two. A tough loss for Volkov here, a hit to his immediate title aspirations, but not the end for him, in my opinion. He comes back, gets a no worthy fight against Tybura and then once again I think he's rolling as a name to watch at heavyweight.